everyone, welcome to another episode of Spitting Venom, aka The Venom Vlog. And today, we just have a little bit of movie news, but I'm not going to dwell on it too much. I have to make this quick because I have to go to work soon. Uh, the, I'll put the link down below. It's an interview with Michelle Williams, and she talked about her character in the movie. A lot of people have been speculating that maybe she'll become She-Venom in the movie, and I, I really hate that name. I kind of like Bride of Venom because that was more like a movie monster-ish, um, even though they were divorced. I, so I guess it's not an accurate name. Uh, but uh, yeah, anyway, so... She's not going to become a symbiote character in this movie, according to her in this interview. So I'll put a link down below. A lot of people out there have been speculating like crazy whether she's going to actually make the full plunge and become a symbiote in the movie. I just feel like that's too much to do. I know a lot of people out there are fans and they want certain moments of their history, of their characters in movies, especially in their first movies. They want everything crammed in. It's like, look... You, you, we have you have to focus on a story like when you're writing something anything superfluous or anything that's like too much you have to cut out and i know a lot of movies don't do that anymore nowadays like everyone wants to make a three-hour epic but really you know you have to look at maybe the two hour marker or, or a little bit less uh, or maybe a few minutes past two hours and just tell like a really solid storyline and i hope that's what they're doing with this and i hope that means that this is a good sign that they're not just cramming things in to cram things in. So hearing her do this interview, talk about that she's just going to be Anne Wang in the movie and she has a pivotal role, that's great. Like I, That's the stuff I want to hear because she does have a pivotal role. She's very integral to Eddie Brock's journey in the comic books. So I'll put a link to that down below um, so you guys can check out that interview. It's not much, but it's there if you want it. And uh, also, if you want some free digital codes, this is a big thank you actually to you guys. We're almost at 700 uh, subscribers. So I have a couple of Venom, uh, or actually a couple of Thor codes that were given to me by my friend Jomily. I'll put like three of them down below in the description box. So check those out. You know, they're all the same comics. So if you get one of the codes, just sound off in the comment section, say like, hey, I used code one. And then so someone else can go, okay, I'll use code two or whatever. Um, try to help each other out if you can. Uh, but those three codes are down below. Put them in if you want a free Thor comic book. Uh, that's all on, you know, all from our friend Jomily. So big thanks to Jomily. Her channel, I'll put a link to that down below on Twitch. She's a great streamer. Plays a lot of Borderlands stuff. Tales from Borderlands, Borderlands 2. She's really great, awesome person, and has contributed a lot to this channel and my Twitch channel. So those codes we're sharing with you guys. So enjoy those. And if you're out there and you want something Venom related, if you're not, uh, you know, want a Thor comic book, which you should because it's a pretty decent issue actually. But this is also Venom Inc. Part 3. I'll put the code here on screen so we have something Venom related to give away. Enjoy that comic book. Um, it just came out this past week. And every week that one of these comes out, I will give away the code. I'll make a short video like this to give away the code. Um, and that's that's pretty much all I really wanted to do on this episode. Uh, I wanted to talk about the Michelle Williams thing. I wanted to thank you guys. We're almost at 700 subs, which is great. I will definitely make a video when we hit 700 or if we hit 700. So if you guys have any suggestions, let me know in the comments down below of what you want me to do if we cross that threshold. Um, I'll definitely do something fun. But yeah, I, it just, it, it really does mean a lot though. I've been sick this week. I know we haven't had a lot of movie news, so I haven't had a ton of stuff to update, which is fine because I've been trying to sleep and get rest this whole time. Haven't been successful at it. I still have this bad case of insomnia, but at least last night I slept pretty good. So that makes me feel great. I have a lot more energy today and I have tomorrow off. So I have to work here like in uh, like 45 minutes. I got to leave for work, uh, but I will be off tomorrow. I'll upload more videos in and I'm off at Christmas and uh, the two days after Christmas. So we'll have a lot more then. Hopefully we'll have more movie news at that point. Hopefully they'll give us all a Christmas present and show us what Venom really looks like because I'm not sure that CGI thing we saw was actual uh, like movie stuff. I don't think that's real. And uh, that's why I was hesitant in the video, but I did want to share it with you guys to get your thoughts on it. So thank you again for watching that video and for watching all of my videos. It really is great to see these videos inching, some of them inching past 100 views and then a couple of them past two, 300 views. Um, that's really awesome. So again, I can't thank you guys enough. Enjoy the comic books, enjoy everything. Hopefully you stick around for the show and this journey that we're going to go on for the next year leading up to the release of this movie. I'm excited. I hope you guys are too. Thanks for watching my videos. Like, share, subscribe, all that fun stuff. I'll see you all in the future. Peace.